Ellipses in informal writing. Making pauses pop. Hello, language learners. Today we're going to dive into the fun and flexible world of punctuation marks, focusing specifically on ellipses and their usage in informal writing. An ellipsis is a series of three dots that indicates an intentional omission of a word, sentence, or whole section from a text. They're also used to indicate a pause in speech, an unfinished thought, or trailing off into silence. So, let's see how to use them correctly. First, let's get to know the ellipsis a little better. Consisting of three dots, an ellipsis can show where you've left something out, illustrate a pause, or indicate that a thought hasn't been completed. In informal writing, such as text messages, social media posts, or friendly emails, ellipses can be used more liberally to mimic natural, spoken language. Now, how do we use ellipses to demonstrate pauses or unfinished thoughts? In informal writing, you can use ellipses to show that you're thinking, unsure, or if you want to leave something unsaid. Example, I was thinking, maybe we could go to the park this weekend? Here, the ellipsis indicates a pause as the writer considers what to suggest. It adds a sense of uncertainty, making the suggestion appear more casual or tentative. While in formal writing, ellipses are typically used to indicate omitted text in informal writing. We often use them to suggest that something goes unsaid or is left to the reader's imagination. Example, he finally asked her out. The ellipsis here implies there's more to the story that the writer has chosen not to include. It might suggest suspense, excitement, or nervousness about what happens next. While ellipses can be fun and add a certain flavor to your informal writing, it's essential not to overuse them. Too many ellipses can make your writing seem hesitant or unclear. So remember, while they're more accepted in casual contexts, use ellipses sparingly and intentionally. That's it for our exploration of ellipses in informal writing. Remember, they're a great tool for adding pauses, suggesting unfinished thoughts, and indicating omissions in a relaxed and informal context. But, just like with any good thing, don't overdo it. We hope you found this discussion helpful. Keep exploring and enjoying the flexibility and fun of the English language.